Canvas friends, are you ready to draw something great? Today we're going to draw sailboats. This was my favorite thing to draw when I was five. I drew sailboats, cruise ships, pirate ships, and I always drew all the fish under the ocean as if you could see through. So today I'm going to just show you how to draw an easy sailboat with um, an ocean tumbling by and maybe even some seagulls in the sky. So get your paper and your crayon out. You know, and you don't always have to draw with black. I like to draw with blue a lot of times because it's just a little bit softer. So pick whatever crayon or pencil you want and your paper and let's draw. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is actually draw the water line because boats aren't just floating in the sky, they've got to be in the water and they, they sink down because they're heavy, so they're in the water kind of deep. So let's draw a line. We're going to draw a wavy line and it's just like this, up, up, up with your curves. Okay, and there is our water line. And you want to draw it all the way from one edge of the paper to the other. It's called the horizon line, so that we get the whole ocean there. Okay, now we're ready for our boat. It is really simple if you just draw a curved line until you touch your water, and then another curved line on this side until you touch your water, and then we're just going to draw a straight line across connecting. And this is the body of our boat. Okay, now, because my dad is a sailor, I've got to teach you how to draw a sailboat. We need a mast, and that's a long pole that goes right up in the middle. So draw a straight line up high, a little short line across, and a straight line right back down. Okay, we're going to draw one straight triangle, and we're going to draw one curved triangle. The straight triangle is going to go on this side. This is a pole right here that comes out, and it's called the boom. You gotta watch out when the wind changes because it whips around and it can knock you off the sailboat. That's what my dad always told me. Nobody ever fell overboard though. Okay, and then we're just gonna draw a straight line from the top to the corner for that sail. Now this sail we're gonna do just a little bit different, but I know you can do it. I want you to start at the top and I want you to draw a curved line down to the bottom of the boat, this edge of the boat, and now draw a curved line into the mast and one more curved line back up here. This is the main sail, and when the wind picks it up, it makes that curve. And you know what? Sometimes you can put on something called a spinnaker, and they're really bold and bright colors. So you could do any details you wanted here and make this sail whatever color you wanted and really fun. Okay, now I always picture a flag on the top of the boat, so let's draw a little flag. I'm just going to draw a circle here, kind of at the top of our mast. And I'm going to draw a curved line and then a flag with curvy lines like this and curvy lines that meet right at the tip. Okay, now to finish our sailboat picture, we're going to add a couple of details. Usually sailboats have a stripe, so I want you to take a straight line across and then one more right next to it, across like that. Okay, and we can put some seagulls in the sky. There's always seagulls on the ocean or where I sailed on the Great Salt Lake, there was a lot of seagulls and they're really easy. Two curved lines. One, two. And then just turn it the other way next time. One, two. Okay, you might even want to add a couple of fluffy clouds. clouds. <laughs> curved lines, again, really easy. Just curve, curve, and you might even just come right into that sail like it's behind the sailboat. Curve, curve, curve right into that sail. That gives our painting a little bit of depth because the cloud's behind the sailboat. Okay, we're just about done. If you want to add anything else, sometimes if you just add a couple more curved wavy lines, gives us a little bit of depth in front. And that's how you draw a sailboat. You guys did a great job today. Remember that you are a great artist. Keep drawing, and I'll see you next time. Bye.